Okay, so part two. So I think this is what most people are interested in. They keep reaching out to me. So you bought a property, you want to lease it, you want to get it out there, you want to make some money, you want to have some tenants, right? And you're wondering, what are the fees? What is it going to cost me? So you can be as hands-on or as hands-off as much as you want, right? The choice is yours. You can be out there screening tenants, you can be unclogging toilets, you can be doing repairs, right? You can be there involved with the property or you can pay a company, a property management company, and that scale can go from here to here, right? The, the less you wanna do, the more it's gonna cost, right? So you may get up to 35% for a company that handles every single thing, including eviction, or you can do it yourself. So eight fees you can expect to pay. You can expect to pay, to pay a setup fee, right? To set the entire contract up a maintenance fee, you can expect to, to pay a management fee, you can expect to pay a vacancy fee, a lease renewal fee, a tenant placement fee, right, where they screen the tenants and they make sure everything is good with the tenants. Uh, an eviction fee, that's something that's not a whole lot of fun. Uh, so having a property management company that's going to handle evictions will take a lot of stress out of your life. And of course, there's also for many companies an early termination fee. So should you say, I want to hire you for this amount of time, and then you want to end that early, you may incur a fee there. For more details to go into the actual stuff in depth and to get all the information from me that I'm talking about here, uh, please just reach out to me. Um, let's schedule a call, uh, send me a message, and we'll go through it in depth.